Hello, it's Lady Liz Gamer, aka Old Lady Simmer. How are all of you doing? I am here to bring you some news. We are bringing back dark novels, and I'm so excited about it. I wanted to do a live recap, which we did on Twitch, but there was a little bit of glitching and game lag. It was a little hard to record at the time, but some stuff went down. And if you were there, you know what I mean. Things got a little crazy. I don't want to give any spoilers. I'm going to put together a little video attached to this, and then I'll be back to talk about it after. So sit back and enjoy. Okay. So meanwhile, back in San Machino, everyone is in the hall and stressed out. Something bad has happened. All the electricity, our electronic items are broken and the lights are out. Something is very wrong, but what is it? I don't know. Let's take a look around and see. Let's go upstairs and... <gasps> oh my God, the baby. The baby's gone. Where could he be? Is it in the wall or something? Something happened. Let's have him go here fast. I had a feeling something bad was going to happen because of the political regimen that, that we're in right now, trying to get the job as head vampire. And why is everything so weird? I mean, look, look where this money bag is shoved in the wall. That would take some extreme power to make this happen. Who was here? What is going on? What is happening? Someone has to make the call. All right, Reese has to do it. Let's have him call Jerome and say that something really horrible has happened. What I've learned so far is we've had to replace all of their electronic equipment and everything here is broken. All the lights were broken, the showers, so they are under some kind of attack. So... I'm gonna have I'm gonna have him call Leia too to tell Leia to be careful and watch out and they're gonna have to send a bodyguard over to take care of her too. But Kent's there. I think he should call Kent instead. That's how I'm scratch calling Leia and have him call Kent. What time is it? It's four it's ten forty four PM. Let's just have him go over there. We're gonna have him go over there and warn them. But he has to be in disguise, right? Or no, you know what? He's not even going to worry about disguise right now, which is a bad idea. But we're going to have him go over there. He can pretend like he's roughing them up or something. I know it's late, but open the door. Okay, so this is the time when Reese went over to talk to um, Kent and Don Lothario and explain to him everything that's been going on, that the baby's missing. Right when Raven walks outside. Not the best scenario, right? So Donna Dario thought it would be best to go outside and bring her back in. Kent is just really pissed off. So they headed over to Jerome's house in Forgotten Hollow. He was already busy trying to see what information he could figure out or find out. And a little distraught. I mean, if you remember what happened to his first child. He does not want a repeat of that. So he's sending out a threatening text. Meanwhile, Naomi is taking matters into her own hands. So they're having an emergency <laughs> meeting on what they're going to do about this situation. Tibbs, Shefinaz, Nabim, Rabaza. Where's my baby? You have them, don't you? One of you has them. Merkid Kaboy. So she's not messing around. She's going to fight with everyone in this house and accuse them of stealing her baby. Gomip, Spubani, Harfase, Hoyvoy. Ugh. Oh wow, 
that's a lot of stuff happening, right? I told you. What do you think is going to happen? How do you think Jerome is going to handle this? Comment below. I'd like to get your input. I think Naomi is handling it quite well. And if you've never watched this series before and it's the first time, I went ahead and linked the playlist below so you could catch up. Some of the first videos are a little rough because it was when I first started recording on a crappy laptop. I just wanted to get my story out there and these characters that mean a whole lot to me. So let me know and join me. Let's see. Join me next week for another episode of Dark Novels where we'll pick up after the fact and hopefully we can find out what's going on and get to the bottom with this. Have a lovely, lovely, lovely week and I will see you next week. Bye-bye.